Hey, welcome back to Dear Mandy. Today, I'm gonna take you on a remote working day as a software engineer. But today, I'm gonna be working remote um, because I'm giving a talk to a group of kind of young teenagers about my journey to becoming a software engineer and how I got there. So that is also already up for that video. So also link it right there and also in the description below. So let me take you on this day and how it's like to work remote as a software engineer. Oh hey, didn't mean to scare you there. I'm just very bored waiting for my next train to come so then I can get to my talk. So actually I had my talk at a co-working space in Berkeley and actually fast forward two hours after I finished my talk I had to solve a bug that I pushed to production oh, so no. that took a little bit of time so now I just got lunch and you can see me basically struggling through opening this box and I was so hungry and <sighs> voila I think I finally got it to open and since I used some time for my talk, I thought I would use utilize some of my lunch time to wrap up some of the smaller things that I had to do. After that, I was basically working for another maybe two hours. Hello, making my way to my next work. Um, location. I'm going to Asha Boba Shop. Um, just kind of need a change in scenery, but look how nice the weather is. <laughs> really nice to be back in Berkeley, but I feel like I'm starting to forget a lot of the streets. But um, anyway, uh, yeah, I really like the weather in Berkeley. It's like a bit hotter, but then at the same time, not as windy as SF, so I really enjoy the weather here. All right, trekking to the next work location. And a few moments later, I got my strawberry black tea from Asha. And obviously, I'm struggling to poke my straw in, so if that happens to you, you can drink and poke at the same time. So there's your pro tip. And some of you who've seen my Instagram would know that I am a big, big boba fan. So if you're in the SF or in the Berkeley area, I would completely recommend you trying out Asha Tea House. It helps that their boba is also sweet and chewy, so definitely recommend it. And also, if you didn't take a picture, did boba really happen? Alrighty, back to work. I'm really trying to get some coding time in now that I'm settled with my boba and I'm all good. So I'm trying to continue working on what I was doing the previous day, trying to and continue to make progress as if I was in the office. And obviously coding is actually just kind of like problem solving. So a lot of the time I still like to use pen and paper to kind of write out and draw out what I'm working on and kind of how that logic is gonna go or if something that I need to visualize is much better and faster if I actually put it on paper and kind of analyze it that way. So I still do that a lot, um, pen and paper, always have it on my desk. So for those of you who've watched my previous day in the life as a software engineer or any other YouTubers day in the life, um, they kind of show more of the little things that they actually do at work as a software engineer. Today, I kind of wanted to show how it's like working remote rather than showing you kind of like the small pieces of the things that I actually do. If you're interested in seeing that, I would really encourage you to go see my other video, A Day in a Life as a Software Engineer, where I worked in an office and I show you a little bit more about the little things that software engineers actually do throughout their day. Alrighty, thanks for stopping by and watching this really short um, remote working day with me. Um, things like this happen and we're pretty flexible in terms of like going to somewhere else to you know, uh, work or like if we have some other obligations or errands to run, we can always do that. And yeah, make sure to go also watch the video about how I got to where I am today. And I'm going to be actually vlogging for the rest of this weekend. So it will be more like a casual 
um, weekend with me as well. So watch out for that in the next week's video, okay? All right, if you enjoyed this day with me, please give me a big thumbs up so I know that you enjoyed it. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell next to it so that you can get notified on whenever I post a new video. And now I'm going to actually go to Foodie Land and Night Market. So that would be perfect. So thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Bye!